Hello everybody, season 12 has started and like usual, I'm here to bring you a guide on how to get your seasonal journey done or some of the things rather that you'll need to get done within your seasonal journey if you want to get everything. Like always, if you want the stash tab that is on the second to last step, which if you don't already have all the max or, or the max amount of stash tabs that you can get, uh, then you'll have to get all the way there in order to get that. Otherwise, if you just want, you know, your awesome wings, then you only need to complete the four chapters. Um, outside of that, if you want all the portrait frames and the stash tab, you'll need to complete pretty much the rest of it. But thankfully, this season, it is really easy to do. There is a lot of really convenient uh, steps in this that kind of complete all of the steps at once. And what I mean by this is there's more uh, steps to the journey that will be part of all of the other steps. And if you can complete the last one, then you complete all of the ones previous to it. For example, getting three gems to rank 70, that's a pretty easy one to do. But what I mean by it's kind of easy because it, it, uh, it will complete all of the ones before, you know, you, you have to get, you know, gems to 30 or 25, 35, 45, 65, and 70. So all of those are completed if you get them all to 70 and they'll complete along the way, obviously. But on top of that, there is a conquest that you'll need to do if you want to complete the three conquests, which will get you, um, one of them done if you get three gems to 65 that is one of the conquests pretty easy right really nice and simple keeps the journey really easy so let's look at some of the stuff uh, that you'll also need to do along the way that will complete it all for this last one if you want the awesome portrait the the final portrait and you want to complete guardian then of course you'll need to complete all of this stuff three gems to rank 70 we already talked about that Story conquest we'll talk about that at the end of the video for which conquests you should be doing or looking out for um Complete a Greater Rift 70 solo. That is, if you do the 70, you know, you obviously get all of the ones previous to it. You'll probably kind of work your way gradually along the way. But this, this is all stuff that you'll be doing throughout the entire journey. And then extract 40 powers into Kanai's Cube. This is all pretty easy. If you do the extract powers into Kanai's Cube, you need roughly 50 for the season, roughly 50 um, bounty mats in order to get everything done between reforging yeah, an item and putting this stuff into Kanai's Cubes. So just kind of look out for that. Obviously, doing all of your bounties will help with that. The only thing that is really difficult about this season, in my opinion, is to kill Skeleton King in level or at level 70 in under 30 seconds on Torment 13. Most people should not have an issue with this, but it is going to be rather difficult for um for some because the countdown starts the moment you start the skeleton king you have to run over there and activate him and then blow him up real quick uh my group of people we did it really really quickly um we did it within like 20 seconds so we still had 10 seconds to spare he blew up really fast but again we were all pretty well geared and ready to go for that that's going to be the most difficult part of this process but you should be able to do it Outside of that, if you're looking just to get your gear and your wings for the season, the awesome, awesome wings, then you're pretty much having to do everything that you would have in the previous seasons. Uh, you'll need to do like all of the, uh, the bounties, right, for like chapter two. This will get you your first piece. You'll need to do, um, you'll need to reach level 70. You'll need to craft some items. You'll need to kill Siege Breaker on hard. You'll need to re-enchant an item transmogrify an item basic stuff this is not going to be difficult you should be able to keep up with that um with chapter three which will get you your four piece bonus right chapter two it's essentially just hit level 70 you'll get two pieces that's the easy part chapter three is complete a nephilim rift on master by the time you get to this point you you would have already done that kill rakanoth at level 70 kill izul at level 70 Obtain all of the bounty caches, right? That's that's something you'll do while leveling up or something you'll do right when you hit max level. Extract an item into the cube, which you'll be able to do with the bounty mats, so on and so forth. Pretty, pretty easy stuff. In order to get your four or your six set bonus and to complete chapter four, you will need to do a couple things that can be kind of difficult. Kill all of the key wardens on Torment 4. Going and finding them on the map, that's pretty easy. You shouldn't have an issue with that. Killing them uh, may require some friends if you're using certain classes. Because certain classes don't get their damage bonus on their sets until their six-piece bonus. Others will have no problem with that. So depending on what class you're getting and what set bonuses you're getting based on what class you're playing, you may need to do that um, you know, with, with other people. 
But outside of that, doing that and then doing your Greater Rift 20 solo will, will net you your um, bonuses, your six set bonus, and, and the rest of the pieces. The only other thing here in order to get your six set that might be difficult for some people is killing Urzael at level 70 on Torment 4. He can be kind of a butthead, but if you get your four set bonus, killing him may be... Um, easy for some you may need one other person with you to help you um, you can join a public game in order to do that outside of that everything else is really easy this season like i said you know essentially just get to level 70 do a greater rift level 70 solo and uh get all your gems to level 70 by getting your gems to level 70 as i said earlier you will complete one of the conquests the conquest is level three gems to 65 which is fairly convenient you'll need three conquests in total all of them are really easy this season Reach Greater Rift level 45 solo without any set items equipped is easy for everybody if you have kind of decent items with good damage bonuses on them. Um, you should be able to come up with something that works. There's a lot of build guides out there for this kind of thing. Years of War, which I decided to do this season, was probably one of the harder ones, but I decided to do it. Reach Greater Rift 55 solo with, the, with six of the set bonuses um, from different classes. So essentially you just collect six sets. So if you have two characters, this is how this will work. You'll have like four sets on one and two on the other or three on one and three on the other. You, you get the math, right? It doesn't really matter. Get six sets together for two different or three, four, four sets together for two different classes. You mix and match whatever you want to do and go and do the Greater Rift's on 55 every set can do greater if 55 solo you just need the set pieces for and maybe some of the supporting items this is a time one if you have the time to do that one it's really easy otherwise it's probably one of the hardest ones on here boss mode is kill all of the bosses on torment 10 within 20 minutes of the start of the game you'll probably need other people to do this and just as a tip if you have another person say you're you know you're a two-person party and you're both running off to one of the bosses that are hard to find, such as Urzale, for example, a good, a good thing to do is if the other person finds a boss and hits it really quick, and you have to be there to kill the boss with them, so essentially kill out any of the things that are attacking you, go back to town, use the their banner to teleport to them, then you kill the boss, and instead of going back to town by using your portal, open your map, go to the town, like click on the town, it will teleport you back. Your portal from where you were will still remain. You walk through your portal, you'll be right back where you were, but you have to go back to town in order to do that from the beginning. So that's that's just a little tip. Outside of that, um, you have your curses, which is that's uh, just kill the 350 enemies in the curse chest event. We've had this, this one for several seasons now. Just go do the cursed Pete in uh, Act 5. It's like the bottom left most one. Just restart your game until you get the Cursed Pete, Cursed Event um, for a bounty, and then go and do that at level or on Torment 10. Pretty easy. But again, if you want to get the seasonal journey done, uh, you'll need to complete all of that. It's the easiest it's ever have been, has been rather. And if you want the stash tab, if you don't have the max stash tabs, you'll just need to complete Conqueror, which is like two conquests, three gems to 55, um, finish a Nephilim Rift on Torment 13 within five minutes which is pretty easy. If you can do the five minute one, you can do the four minute one, which is for the guardian. And then, you know, use Kanai's cube to reforge a legendary item. You'll need five of each bounty mat in order to do that. Um, put a level 50 gem into your items and in into an ancient item. Uh, what I would suggest is if you're going to level three gems up and get them all to level 70, if you want, you can then kill one of those gems and put it into one of your items or just level a fourth gem up like a Boon of the Hoarder, for example, and get it to level 50 and then sacrifice that gem later. Outside of that, this season's really easy and I'm pretty sure all of you should be able to finish it and you shouldn't really have any issues. If you have any suggestions, leave them in the comments below for other people. It's always nice to kind of learn new things of, you know, different tricks and tips that you're able to do. But, you know, outside of getting the wings, which are pretty cool looking, and the portrait and the stash tab it's just another season to to get done with that being said though we shall see you guys next time